Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah. Shit, God. Yeah, nice to get wide shit. <laughs> Fuck that shit. I, I, I ain't hitting that bitch, mom. Shit. Perfect. Live in the motherfucking building, man. It's Wednesday in this motherfucker. It's today Wednesday, right? Hump day. Motherfucker hump day and shit, dog. When the stainless get IG popping and shit, we'll get IG live popping, man. Everybody checking in. iHeartRadio, Pandora, motherfucking Spotify. All that good shit, man. Yeah, talk to us. We talk back. For sure. Real quick, dog. As always, man, want to give a shout out to my whole motherfucking squad, dog. E Block Radio Podcast Network, dog. <clears throat> shout out to Podcastic. Shout out to the Plug Podcast. Shout out to the uh, New Orleans Talk Network, dog. Whole motherfucking squad. We like BMF in this bitch. Yeah, <laughs> we going state for state recruiting this shit, nigga. We a whole gang gang in this bitch. Y'all niggas ready, dog? Let's go. All right, let's get to this shit. Let me see. IG, yep, we on. All right, let's do it, dog. Yo, 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 you know what it is, man. The live is cloud radio show on the planet. Earth cuz. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial. Right this moment, man, this is the Wake and Bake Show, dog. I got my man Angry Man holding it down. Yeah, I'm here. My man Monk Money in the building. You know it, babies. And, of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205. Man, let's get to the shits. It's Wednesday motherfucking morning, dog. Hump day like a sun, bitch. Hump day like the a The sun out on this motherfucker, dog. I'm so excited. 55, baby. We got dog. 55 today. 55 today? 55 Shit, today. I'm putting something on the grill. 55 <laughs> Put some meat on your grill. <laughs> I know I had to say that shit, dog. That's a good idea, dog. No, 55, we gotta put something on the motherfucking grill. Day. Oh, shit, you off the plantation today, too? Outside yeah. today. Man, what? I'm about to put all kind of motherfucking beefs on the grill. Oh, shit. <laughs> that sounds like a Shit, it might be, though. Shit, ain't gonna rain and no goofy shit. I don't know, dog. All right, we in the building, man. Let's check it in. We got a uh, corporate Cody checking in on IG. May May, what up, though? She's checking in from uh, North Kakalaki and shit. North Kakalaki. Angry man, what's the deal, dog? What's, what's popping with you, dog? It's Wednesday, middle of the week type shit. What's good with you? Nothing. All righty. Dog, what this nigga say? Dog, man, man said, P, put some bass in your voice. You're alive. <laughs> who, who said that? Nobody. <laughs> <laughs> no, I put some volume in your motherfucking voice. That's about it. No, I ain't about to be yelling through this motherfucker, man. No, you just gonna talk regular at some point and shit. I ain't right? talking was... regular. All right, there we go. We got a little, we got a little something in there. I think. Anyway, what's up, little you, voice? Dog? Ass up, boy. Little voice. This nigga said little voice. What's good with you, dog? I know some guy be popping, dog. You done made it to Wednesday. It's the middle of the week. That's something to celebrate, I suppose. I don't know. I'm off, so I figure out what people do when they off. No. That's what's up. Well, my nigga Jay just checking in. What up, dog? Broski, Roski. Broski, Roski. <laughs> but, buddy, dog, what's popping with you, dog? I know you got something to say. Shit. You already you know, been, man. You been gone since last week and shit, Hell dog. What's yeah, with man. I've been in, 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 in New Orleans, bitch. In New Orleans. <laughs> New Orleans, bitch. <laughs> Word. That shit was live, though, man. Shit, I ain't even gonna lie to you, This nigga man. come back talking country and shit. You hear me? <laughs> hey. I met a lot of Detroiters down in that thing. Shit. Man, we every fucking way, bro. Everywhere, boy. This yeah. motherfucker, old motherfucker, walk up on me with some $10 grams of Reggie's and shit. Like, that nigga said the Reggie's. <laughs> the Reginals. The Reginals. <laughs> like, dog, I'm straight on that, baby. But yeah. it, was, it was easy to um, find some um, veg out there, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I mean, shit, motherfuckers walking up the street like, I got that good, got that good. And they yeah. had something like that. And I know you be worried. That'd be the first thing you be worried about and shit. Yeah, you know. This nigga ain't worried about his safety, housing, none nothing, of that shit. Where the weed at? Hell yeah, cause <laughs> I, I gotta maintain while I'm there, bro. So yeah. I was scared to the motherfucker on the way there, though. Like, god damn, I call my homeboy. I used to stay in New Orleans. Like, dog, you got yeah. somebody can plug me, you know what I'm saying? Dog, he trying to pull up on anybody yeah. who got it. Man, as soon as I walk to the from the hotel, motherfucker say, uh, <laughs> I bet you got that weed. 
Like, oh, hey, hey, come here. Let me you see said, what you're talking uh, about. Need that. Need Let me that. see what you're talking about. And then people I was with, like, damn, you just walking up on people? Like, no, they saying it, motherfuckers. Y'all just ain't hearing it. Because <laughs> they, they ain't listening for what you listen no, for. No, no, they saying it, but they ain't hearing it. So, you know, so it's pretty easy to get, <laughs> get some, um, it's always, some It's bad. always easy to get drugs when you're out of town. Food. That's not that easy. Let me tell you something. I was getting to that um, people, angry man. Let me tell you something. I had these fucking oysters, bro. Oysters. And, these bitches was so good, bro. Like everywhere I stopped, I grabbed me. A, they were I like, never even had oysters. They were like six or fourteen. Yeah. Everywhere I stopped, I grabbed me a bitch. Six or fifteen. <laughs> <laughs> I grabbed me. I grabbed a bitch everywhere I stopped, man. Yeah. The bitches was so good, man. The food was, food was excellent. The food bro. was everything you thought it was gonna be. Everything I, I know that's all, the only reason you went was yeah, for the food. Everything, yeah. everything I thought it was gonna be, man. Yeah. I went to the first restaurant I went to. I told them give me something like catfish. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Man, they gave me like 20 pieces of catfish sitting on this motherfucker. Like, ooh, lordy, lordy, lordy. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga singing, dog. Ooh, lordy, fat. I had to do the fat dude dance like, bitch. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> hey, it was and that shit was fire, though? That shit was fire. And I went to another restaurant called Nani's Black Owned Shit. I was trying Nani's. to hit every black owned thing I could possibly hit. Yeah. But uh, we went to some shit called uh, Neow's. Neow's. Yeah, what the fuck is that? Yeah, it's mm. as good as a motherfucker. I tell you that. I know the seafood shit, fire and shit. Huh? It, it, it's a little farther away from the motherfucking um, Bourbon Street and all that shit. It was like damn near in the hood almost. You know. What I'm oh, where? Man, they said from where? Monk. She said she loved oysters. You know? Oh, you said you was getting a bitch from everywhere. Everywhere, knee house, oyster yeah. bar, everything. Yeah. Everywhere in New Orleans. No, everywhere in New Orleans. My nigga Drink Swift just checked in. What up, though, man? Check out my dog Word on the Street podcast, man. Make sure you check out my dog. He on Facebook, dog Drink Swift. Uh, Spank just checking in. What up, though? Tone the barber checking in. What up, though? Check out my man Tone. The shit set the tone podcast, man. Go to his IG page. You can get that YouTube link and all that good shit, dog. Yeah. See, your ass busting down oysters and shit. Busting oh, bitches down. Bust. <laughs> all week. Bust. <laughs> Bus <laughs> Two shots No give me six of them Hey this nigga Bus. still This nigga still excited That food must have been Good as that fuck That was fire Yeah Damn, I ain't never even Fucking had oysters Like I don't even know What them bitches taste like A lot of people say See, they I don't it. really I don't eat a lot of Seafood shit so You wouldn't know, you know Yeah I wouldn't know yeah. I mean yeah. some people say It's an aphrodisiac I don't know I don't know if it's aphrodisiac. Yeah, I don't you trying to fuck anyway, so it yeah, doesn't matter. I'm trying, I'm, trying, I'm trying to get it in any fucking <laughs> any way. Fucking way so right. I don't even know, but them bitches was good, though. I ain't yeah. gonna lie to you. They had some, like, Parmesan, garlic butter crust on top of them bitches and shit. He making that shit sound delicious. Man, <laughs> I'm looking right. And with the herbs all over that bitch. Yeah. I, I got pictures. I just come to my page and check it out, man. Them bitches <laughs> were good. Yeah, for sure. Them bitches were good. That's what's up. What was the weather like? Because I heard when it rained down there, that bitch, it rained forever. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. It was beautiful. Damn, you man, you got it. Hey, you got hey, lucky, it, was it was like seventy. My nigga, Bo just checking in. What up, though? It was like seventy four the first day. Seventy. God damn. Then the second day was like seventy nine. Then it was eighty one, and then it was eighty one. But with, with, with rain. God so, damn. My, my last day. My man Drew said he angry now, dog. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, that's that shit do good. sound good. Though. Jambalaya, crawfish. Oh man. Yeah, from where that shit originated. Oh though. man. Sure. Oh. Man, I had some shit right. Hey, did y'all go to the hood though, or did y'all did y'all leave like the first quarters? Nihau. That's that's in the hood. That's in the hood. Oh, okay, I got you. So we went to fucking um this 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 tour like these ghost tour. We went on a ghost tour. That was shit was shitty. Oh, I seen I seen that shit like y'all was in a boat or some shit. No, that was a go. That was the the swamp tour. Okay. So we went to the ghost tour. The shit was some bullshit. We we. Cut out on their ass. Ghost was, like ghost ghost? Like ghost ghost. But Get it was the a, fuck out of here. But it was weak. It wasn't they ain't take us in nowhere. You know yeah, what I'm saying? They probably they couldn't walking the past shit. and shit, just talking about the shit and walking past and just it's talking probably, about it. If you could go in, it's probably some spooky shit around that bitch though. But man, I left I left that There's a lot of voodoo tour. shit going on there. Because I wasn't walking it. It was a two hour walk. A two hour yeah. Two you hour walk. Yeah, the crib goes to it. Tall girl there? Tuesday nah. checking in with her though. <laughs> nah. <laughs> I got that bitch about a half an hour in, like, bro. I ain't bought this life, bro. Two hour, nigga. I ain't bought it. I'm done. I was probably gonna have some chucks on too. It'd been a wrap. We walked about twenty miles around that thing. This nigga said twenty miles. Twenty plus. Damn, work that motherfucking seafood off. Hell yeah, hell yeah. So it, I ain't gonna look this bad because I was this, eating like a motherfucker. This nigga exaggerated. Like, damn, where y'all walking on fucking twenty miles? Twenty miles, easy that whole weekend. That nigga easy. said easy, easy, damn. maybe more, nigga. What yeah. the fuck you talking about? We ain't had no rental. Feet on fire. We ain't had no rental on shit. So yeah. in that case. I see the little motherfucker. Hey, Mitash, 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 $30, Mitash. 
Yeah, bitch. First of all, <laughs> first of all, this nigga here will get a massage anyway. Real quick, I got to tell the story, y'all. You know? So we in Colorado, though. That's why I was living in Colorado. And him and uh, two G's pulled up on me and shit out there. So we in the mall and shit. We fucking around and shit. He run past this little. Look, I don't know, Korean nigga or some shit. Matach? No. <laughs> He's like, nigga, I'm getting a massage. I'm like, dog, from little dog over there. <laughs> like, I don't know if they doing manicures, pedicures, and motherfucking massages this bitch. Dog, no, he was whooping monk ass, though. Like, I'm talking about, this nigga has an elbow on this nigga, dog. You should have seen this nigga face. You just thought he was fucking what? <laughs> dog, 2G's had a video of that shit, dog. Uh, like, this nigga, shit. Dog, this nigga was massaging shit on <laughs> Hey dog, the massage? Man, that shit was good. This nigga for sure is gonna eat and find somewhere to get a massage, nigga. This, massage? this is what this nigga do. Thirty five dollar massage? So yeah. Saying, so basically what you saying, we need to quit bullshit and get one of them. Man, bro. That's what he be that saying. That shit was man. immaculate, bro. Like I'm in that motherfucker like, oh my god, motherfucker <laughs> rub my feet for thirty minutes, nigga. <laughs> nigga thirty, 30 minutes. minutes rubbing my feet, bro. Like, oh god, shit. Thirty minutes on the foot. How much do that shit cost, nigga? Fifty dollars combination. You want body and feet? Fifty dollar. Fifty dollar. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Fly lights, right? Yeah. That's a motherfucking fried rice in that motherfucking up. Fly lights. But it was live though. Like man, shit. I, 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 hey, life unplugged. Just checked out. He said, uh, "Yo, them little Chinese dudes will fuck you up with oh, the massage." Oh man. He said they be doing karate on your hell <laughs> yeah. They put elbows, karate chops. Like dog for sure shit. has elbow all in my man. Shit, dog. Yeah, that shit was. When drink swift say happy ending massage. <laughs> Thank you, man. No, 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 ten minutes. He said no ten minutes. <laughs> hey, you know what? I got a masseuse for you, man. Mm -hmm. Bet the house podcast is uh, popping in. What up, though? That can go with you on your shelf on your doorstep. Oh, that's dope. That's dope. What the fuck? That's a whole that should be a thousand dollars. I mean, holy shit! Like you want a dinner and a massage and motherfucking these drinks, man, dog. That's you a whole fucking day experience. Hey, that's dog, a package. That's a, man, that's a whole package. That's, that's, a package. that's a package, bro. That's a package, package. You gonna be some perking after that for real? <laughs> no, we gonna talk or about sleep. <laughs> we gonna talk about it. Uh, you know, I mean, they ain't gotta go every time you go, but sometimes if they come, you know, yeah. you could charge a little bit more. You get the little, little deluxe package, nigga. You said sure. deluxe, dude. That's sure. that's wild, right there. For the couples, yeah. You, know, you get a massage while this nigga in there cooking, yeah. Mm. Hey, what? <laughs> Never mind, dog. Uh -uh. Anyway, keep up, keep moving, dog. What else happened, dog? I mean, that was it. That was it for you, boy. You know what I'm saying? I had a nice time, dog. Dude. I almost knocked this. Excuse my French, I have no problem with gay people, but I almost knocked this fucking dyke bitch out, bro. For what? This I'm, I'm speaking, all... speaking of gender roles, which we were talking about today. Yeah, that's that goes along with the topic. <laughs> ah. But I'm getting out the fucking van, you know, the, you know, the carport where they come take you to get your carport. Okay. So these motherfuckers ain't got nothing to do with social distance in this motherfucker. They got niggas piled up in these bitches. That nigga right? said nothing to do with that shit. Nothing to do with that shit. <laughs> they got niggas piled up in that bitch for one. So I get okay. to the motherfucker, bro. And then we get to our car, and it's a dyke bitch in the front seat, and yeah. I'm right next to the door handle, right? Okay. So I open the door handle, boom, you know what I'm saying, trying to get the dog and get everybody out. Mm. Man, I put my hand on the thing, she slammed my shit in the door. Bah! Slammed your hand Slam in the my hand in the door, I'm looking. This bitch, I'm, just, I'm like, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. She's standing there, dog, looking like, like. I'm like, man, open the fucking door. Oh, what? So, so the uh, dude that was driving, man, he ran around, get the door. He was holding my hand, holding now my they, hand. Now they got it. They do got it to a thing. Now that somehow they constructed to where it won't tear your motherfucking the hand, hand off. off. Yeah. yeah. So you it, know what it, it just slapped back my knuckles. Back in the day, though, shit. Yeah. Back in the day, he used to take a nigga arm mm -hmm. off. Yeah. Old hand off. But, you know, it just slapped my knuckle really yeah. hard. But I'm like, oh, fuck. No, she just standing there, right? She, so got, man, she got shook. My man, my man grabbing my hand. And I said, man, let me the fuck go, bro. Yeah. Don't touch me no more, bro. Right. Like, don't touch me no more, bro. Yeah, because if it's fucked up, you fucking it up. Yeah, you fucking it up. Yeah, sure. So, this little bitch just take a few. So she in the line trying to get her car. And I'm just standing there like a shark, just watching her ass. Like, she looking back at me scared. You know, Duh, you look scared. <laughs> You look at that back at me scared, bro. I'm just sharking around her ass. And she walked off. I wanted to say, bitch, you could have said sorry, but I didn't say nah because I, I think I terrified just sharking her ass. See, her ass is scared, though. That's, that's she, ran, she, she ran to her car. She was black or white? Black. Yeah, she was just scared, nigga. You just scared her ass. You be forgetting like you're not a little motherfucker and but shit. But she like. bust my knuckle, didn't even say right. my That's bad, why she though. got scared, motherfucking shit. All you had to say is, and I'm you sorry. probably standing next to the other big motherfucker and shit. Everybody's scared. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker about 612 and shit. <laughs> Duke and Dave Detroit just checking in. What up, though? Uh, I think the Spanish said it sounds like a problem. 40 ounce can solve your 
<laughs> oh, you want to hear when we was telling the stories about how this nigga was smashing niggas in the face with 40 ounce bottles. Oh, who yeah, the fuck did that? Spank. That's his weapon of choice and shit. Dre said, bottles. Yeah, Dre said, what up, dog? He said, welcome back, Mark. What, what up, dog? Dog, that shit funny as hell, though. So besides having to uh, almost beat up a dike and shit, you ate a lot of oysters and shit, yeah. have fun. I had fun. I had a ball, man. Best trip I had in a while. And I'm glad man. the weather was good, though, because I, I heard the weather be fucked up sometimes. Like, when it rained, it'd be like that swamp yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. But sure. the swamp tour was the best thing, too, bro. I ain't even yeah. though. That shit was live, bro. I, I'm going to tell you all about one item I had. One item. And then, then I'm done. Okay. The motherfuckers had some hot crackling. So everybody in the motherfucker, when we go, that's when we go outskirts. We gone out this motherfucker going yeah. to the swamp. So I'm like, hot crackling. What, what the, the fuck, fuck is, is that? that? But I know what crackling is in the hood of the little pork skins. I fuck with yeah. it. Is that what they talk about? Man, hell yeah. This bitch was a hot dog? Fresh and hot, nigga. Man. Oh, like hot out the oven. Out the grease. Oh, shit. What? <laughs> that bitch was so good, bro. Nigga, chewing was, fat. Hey, <laughs> fat good. and skin. Fat and skin. That's what it is. This shit was so good, bro. I'm like, damn, so it's what the crackers is before they put them in the bag here and shit. Yeah. They damn. Hot. Fresh and hot, bro. That shit might be good. That shit was fire. So I get in that motherfucker. I say, damn, I'm just like, I'm going to try them. So everybody was like, I don't know what that shit is. I ain't trying. Like, it's it's crackers, nigga. Yeah, it's crackers, yeah. nigga. What can the bells be? So I right. grab me a Skins. bag of them bitches. I'm on my way to the motherfucking thing. I say, bro, taste these motherfuckers. Yeah. He say, God damn. He's like, man, can we go back? He's like, the bus about to leave. So we get on the bus. I say, man, can you, uh, can we stop and get some crackling before we pull out here yeah. one more time? You know what I'm saying? Like, all right, just make it fast. Phew. Like four or five people jumped off that, that shit. That shit was fire, huh? Yeah, that shit was good as hell. Damn. Man. Hot crackling. Hot crackling. Hell, uh, uh, Black Molly checking in. What up, though? Uh, Shy just checked in. He said, <laughs> blessings to the Wake and Bake Show. May God bless y'all mics. Thank you, <laughs> This nigga, man. Hey, what time you get off, dog? It's going to be 55 today, man. We want to put something on the grizzly. It's going to be 55 today. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Should do that shit for real, for real. Oh, no. I guess we got to come get wings and shit at the uh, Easy Street Yeah, man. Song. Come show your boy. Yeah, never man. mind. We go get some wings. <laughs> we'll barbecue. Don't forget, man. It's, uh, it is uh, Wing Wednesday and shit. 75 cent wings today. At uh, Easy Street Saloon, man, 16101 East 10 Mile Road, dog. Pull up on my man, yeah. Chef Monk, slanging chickens out the kitchen and shit, dog. Mm -hmm. um, let me see real quick, dog, I guess, because we about to get to our for real topic and shit. Um, like, I ain't had nothing exciting like that. Nigga, I ain't got no swamp tours and no shit. But uh, what I did do, though, uh, yesterday, um, shout out to the squad over at Podcasting, too, dog. We had a good show uh, on the, uh, the Girth Men's Talk Show and shit. Make sure you check that out on uh, simplypodcasting.com. Um, but real quick, last night I started watching. I didn't finish it, but I started watching the Biggie, uh, the Biggie joint on Netflix. Did y'all start watching that I shit at all? A little bit. Yeah, I watched a little bit of it. What um, is it? It's a, it's a like a documentary on Netflix about Biggie. Um, hmm. It ain't, it ain't about like none of the regular shit. It's, it's really about his whole childhood. So this shit kind of, shit kind of interesting. I mean, they got some old ass videos. I'm gonna tell you that they got some old ass videos of him and little C's and shit. And now I understand why they had this little, this little ass nigga. Playing that that part and shit on the movie because like Lil C's was really that fucking little dog mm -hmm. like that shit was I, cause I guess I remember it like after they kind of got grown and shit but when they showed them old shits like this was really a little nigga like he looked like a little kid for real mm -hmm. like all on tour and shit looking like he twelve mm -hmm. so like then it made sense I'm like damn I, cause when I seen the movie I was like damn why they got this young ass nigga playing this part. But it's like, it makes sense now after I seen it, but... They talk about MC Quest. Yeah, 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 they talk about all that shit. And, um, and it was spelled crazy, too. I want to say it was spelled, like, C-W-E-S-T or some shit. It was something crazy like that. But, um, what, uh, what happened was... Oh, shit, this nigga, I know I'm gonna choke on motherfucking air, nigga. He rolled his big-ass finger, too. Um, what the fuck was I getting ready to say? I done got nervous and shit with this fucking blunt. Oh, no, nah, um... What what's kind of fucked up, dog, is that like they showing all these childhood niggas like C Gutter and shit, motherfucker D Rock, obviously, uh, and a couple other niggas that I ain't recognize. All these kind of niggas who kind of influence. I ain't, yeah, I'm gonna say influence them to do bad shit, like sell crack and shit like that. It's fucked up though. It's like all the niggas still alive, bro. It's like the one nigga who made it out is the nigga who died. It's fucked up when you look at it like that, though. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? It happened like that sometime. Yeah, Majority yeah. I got a story to tell. That's it. Yeah. Um, oh, Spank, dog. You and Drew, dog, pull up on me, nigga. You know where I'm at. Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays, nigga, pull up. You don't need no invite. I don't, niggas, niggas be killing me. Man. Talking about they need an invite, dog. You know where we at. Pull up, nigga. <laughs> That's all you gotta do. We gonna stop saying shit to the motherfuckers. Yeah, for bro, sure. We tell them every fucking week. Hell I yeah. tell them motherfucker every week. Uh huh. Um, like, you know exactly where we at. We on the block, motherfucker. All right, so look, this is what we about to do before I start choking death. 
Okay. We about to go to well, a commercial break, then we gonna get back to our for real topic. If you were checking us out on IG, Twitter, all that good shit, dog. Today we talking about gender roles, dog. Should they exist, dog? I'm gonna break it down exactly what gender roles are when we get back, and we gonna talk about, it, dog. Should they still exist, man? But we gotta go to commercial break real quick so I can smoke this weed and not choke on air. Uh, so till then, dog, we'll be right back. Uh, you already know what it is: the Live is Cloud Radio Show on the planet Earth, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Straight from the E Block Radio. Live on your dial right this moment, man. This is the Wake and Bake Show, dog. We'll be back in like one minute. Wake your ass up. It's the Wake and Bake Show. Live on eblockradio.com. The E Block Radio Podcast Network loves our fans, and we need your help. Click the link in the description and become a patron on our Patreon page. You can help us continue to deliver informative and funny entertainment as we've always done. But not only that, you'll have a chance to win free gifts, cash prizes, and get access to behind the scenes footage, videos, and photos. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead and click that link in the description and become a patron on our Patreon page. Pardonmyeastside.com. We've got t-shirts, long sleeve tees, snapbacks, skull caps and yeah we even got hoodies use the promo code eblock radio to get 15 percent off right now wake your ass up it's the wake and bake show live on eblockradio.com check one check two check one check two man we live back in the motherfucking building dog over here choking to death Huh. All right, let me catch my motherfucking breath, dog. Shit crazy out here. All right, we back in this thing, man. You already know what it is. The Live is Cloud Radio Show on the planet. Earth Cup. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial right this moment, man. This is the Wake and Bake Show. Got my man Angry Man and Monk Money holding it down. Yep. Mm-hmm. And, of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live. From the 48205, man, let's get to the shits, dog. Um, my man Bo said him and Square headed to Easy Street on Saturday, so what's up? We let's go, see my guys. Uh, <laughs> my nigga Spank said, blow that shit out, nigga, I need to. GG just checking in, what up, dog? Um, all right, so let's get to it, dog. We talking about gender roles, nigga. Like, are they still important? Should they still be happening? All right, so gender roles, dog, just so y'all know. Uh, is the role or behavior learned by a person as appropriate? To their gender, determined by the prevailing cultural norms. All right, so what that means is, uh, in layman's terms, do niggas need to do nigga shit and bitches need to do bitch shit? <laughs> so something like that and shit does. You know what I'm saying? So, in some places, gender roles are a lot tougher. Like a lot of countries is like women are they strictly they don't work. All they do is domestic shit. You know what I'm saying? So, like some gender roles in places are tough. But for us in America, dog, do you think the motherfuckers should still exist? Angry man, dog, what you say, dog? Gender roles, should they still exist? Hello? No. <laughs> I, I, didn't, yeah, I was trying to figure out what was happening here. Hello? A lot of dead air and shit. <clears throat> nah, I don't think they should exist, man. I mean, because what, 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 how do you distinguish what's a gender role, man? I just explained I mean, but the cultural that, norms, nigga. What, 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 what the cultural norms are. Men are protectors and, and providers and shit, right? So if gender roles don't exist, then that term don't exist. I mean, so explain I, that. I mean, shit. I mean, the shit's supposed to be equal. That that I mean, that comes all the way down to breaking down who takes out the trash and who washes the dishes. Yeah. You know what I mean? So if I got a house full of girls, these motherfuckers ain't going to take no trash out. Because ain't no, you know, I'm not, I don't, I'm not the only one to put trash in there, so I'm not going to be the only one taking it out. So you bring it down to the to the bare minimum, though. Let's let's go back to what I just said. What about that term about how women look for men to be protectors and providers? No, you need to protect and provide as well. It shouldn't just be all solely my job. <laughs> you believe that? Yeah, I do. you just you just saying that, or you believe that? No, I do believe that. How, how, you can't say it's equal if you don't have the same amount of responsibility as I have. So you expect a woman to be a protector and a provider in yeah. real life. What if I ain't at home? What you gonna do? Wait till I get home? What if I get sick and I'm in the hospital? Ha <laughs> ha. Get up off your dead ass and do something. <laughs> I I just don't I don't know, <laughs> dog. No, fuck that. This is the, it's easier when in the nineteen seventies when milk was twenty five cent and bread was sixty nine cent. 
and gas was <clears throat> probably ten cent. Mm -hmm. It's a different time. You know what I mean? It, it, it probably I'm not gonna say easier on them, but it's a different time. Hey, so did you see? Uh, did y'all see uh, us? I think that's the name of no, it. Right? I ain't seen it. Damn, y'all ain't seen that shit. No, no. Damn, I can't even use. Well, I'm gonna use this analogy anyway. People who are watching right now, I'm gonna read y'all comments in a second. Um, but uh, <clears throat> on us, right? The the woman, the the mother in the in the movie was a motherfucking gangster. Like she was the one doing all the motherfucking killing and protecting the kids and shit. And the dude was like kind of a, like kind of a bitch, man, for real. And that's the thing. Like when you see that role reversal, I I don't know if it's just because of how society made it, you know, put it in our heads. But that shit to me was unacceptable. It was unacceptable for the dude to be the weak ass nigga and the and the woman. Be, I didn't but, but say you, that. It was it was weird. It's, it's fucking it's unacceptable. But my thing is that. like, hold on, that's that's that's. That's clearing the the lines of gender roles and shit. But my thing is, it's exactly what it's what a you lot said. of great women in history. It's a lot of great women that had held up and held shit down in history, mm -hmm. bro. And without them playing them roles and the bitch that they had didn't play their so, role. So I'm gonna give you, be, it, I'm gonna give you another example. What about what's called? I didn't say bitch up. I, I, that I did not That's say. That's what I didn't say. Cause on Rosewood, the mom on Rosewood was a beast. Yeah, but the nigga was a beast too, though. The, the, there the, you the, have the it. son. But but dog in this movie was not though. Yeah, I, I don't at I, all. I didn't say that. I didn't say so that. So that means, but I'm just saying. So, it, but but he can though because gender roles don't exist. So he can he can be a whole bitch in the situation. That's on him. <laughs> and that ain't shit unacceptable. It's, and, it's and very it's on, very dog. unacceptable. I didn't say go home and bitch up. <laughs> Right, so, I didn't say I, you. You trying to make what your story with what the movie is what I said, but that's not what I said. It is what you said. No, it is not. If you don't believe in gender roles, then it's okay for him to do that. No, no, it that's, yes, that's it not, is. No, it you, you don't no, it make it okay. Bro, it that, so it what do it make it? What you mean? It, why, it why, make it acceptable. Why does it make it? Why, what, what makes it okay? Because you said that gender roles shouldn't exist. That's why it make it okay. Why the fuck is? Why y'all don't understand what I'm saying? Because you, no, you if don't you, if you say that gender roles shouldn't exist, then that mean that that nigga acting like a bitch is okay. That's acceptable. No, that's what you're not. saying. No, it, it, even no, if you had not, gender bro. roles, you still gonna have niggas that some it's niggas not. don't act gonna act like that. No, it's not, bro. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I don't know where he coming from. Uh, hey, so look, I'm uh, hold on. Uh, Tom, Tom the barber just checked it. He said men should be men and women should be women. Of course, everyone can work, etc. But I don't want my woman acting like a man. No. That's, but I'm a, I'm, I didn't say that either. Uh, Spank said, "I think it boils down to whatever is negotiated within that relationship." No, I didn't what, say she had to act like a man. She, but she could step up and be just as strong as me and, and stay in your role as a woman. I want being you to be strong. strong as me. How can you say? Hold or on, strong? How can you say stay in your role and say that there shouldn't be gender roles, nigga? What role? If it ain't none. What is he talking about, man? So I'm really so confused. this is the question. I said, should gender roles exist? Really you confused. said no. No, I and then you so. say she can stay in her role. How does she stay in a role that you said shouldn't exist? Because see, everybody keeps. You don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, no, she can be. She can still be a woman and still do woman shit, but do it strongly. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I don't want no weak ass woman. I want a weak bitch. I don't. You don't. I want somebody that's going. So you think a woman want a weak ass dude? No, some she shouldn't. Do. She shouldn't. Some of them do. They some of them like to control, control some and manipulate. Them. Yes, they do. Some and of some, sister, so. and some, some of them are just strong mm -hmm. women that you just can't you can't do nothing about. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It's a, it's a lot of strong women that's just out here, dog. You can't fucking do nothing about it. You can't do nothing about it. You either gonna roll with them or get rolled over. I'm not saying that you go home and bitch up. You still play yo. You still a man. Like mm -hmm. you, you, you the man. But still, she is fucking outspoken and do what she do. You just stay right I, there I need, and, and be a bodyguard. Know, shit. I need to know if something happened to me. You gonna hold it? You can be able to hold this bitch Hell down. Yeah. How many black families you seen fold because daddy passed away? Mama couldn't handle it. A lot. Okay, that that's all I need to know. If something happened to me, you gonna hold this bitch down? That's what I you need to, to know. I don't want nothing weak around me. I need, to I, just, know, I need to know if I get sick and can't work. You can you can you can run this bitch. Hell yeah. I need to know put you this, can run this motherfucker. Put this motherfucker on your back. I don't need you sitting over there in the corner crying with the kids. I need to know that you can run this bitch. So so while while you around, who running this shit? We running it together. I'm how, still how is that though? It's I'm a team a, effort. I'm still the man of the house, but we're gonna do it. I don't see, I don't understand. So if you say you say I need to know that you can hold it down if I fall off and shit, right? Mm-hmm. That mean that you you the motherfucker carrying it. Mm -hmm. So there is a there is a, a clearly defined gender role there. 
that you said shouldn't exist. But so nigga, you can't do both. That's all I'm saying. You he can't said, say. Oh he said though. Dog. <laughs> he said what? Okay. Well, God doesn't explain to me. No. Shit. Check it out. He's saying though, it's gonna be a role in 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 in, in anything, but mm-hmm. it's it's it don't have to be like a gender role. Who got this and who did? We supposed to be together, and as a together as a team, you supposed to work this shit out. You know what I'm saying? Like if I, like he said, if he fall off, he feel like shit. Old old girl can take care of it. Right, I'm cool. When I bounce back, I'm back on. We need somebody that can stand up and stand up on their own. That's all we said. Strong women. It's some strong fucking women out here. You you just can't do nothing about. And you can't keep fucking trying to twist the question up and keep saying so it is some strong women, right? Definitely. So let, let's just go back to uh, cultural norms and what's normally said, right? So it has always been known, and women always say that they want a man who can protect and provide, right? For sure. Have you ever heard a man say, "I need a woman who can protect and provide"? That's because his pride won't allow him to say This it. is a yes or no question. No. Yeah, uh, yes. No. You heard a nigga say that he want a woman who can protect and provide. Who is this man? You. I ain't never said no shit like that. I want a woman that can protect and provide. Mm-hmm. Niggas, please explain when I said that. Hey, I ain't saying nothing, but I would like, I would like, if I, if I, if I ran across it in my past and something happened like that, yes, I would like, I, I, I told her, I'd be Mr. Mom I'm like saying. a motherfucker. I wish everybody yeah, Mr. Mom, Mr. Mom has a nigga actually said that that's what he wanted, though. M- Mr. Mom. Dude. And the reason I say niggas ain't never said that is because in, y- in our minds, there are clearly divided gender roles and for y'all niggas to sit here and act like there should not be an existence of those it's uncanny I'm okay. appalled I'm clutching my pearls okay gotcha. <laughs> I'm just saying that's why you got pearls on <laughs> <laughs> oh but there ain't no gender roles I should be able to wear pearls though where, 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 I should be able to wear pearls I, I wish every baby mama would be saying I I, I I I could be a protector and provider. I, I wish you. I wish it was more mamas out there that would say that. Yeah. Maybe I'm old school, dog. I'm not with that shit. Like I'm not like I think there are clearly defined gender roles. Hey, because you ran across a couple strong women in your past. For uh-huh. sure, for sure. Yeah, but you know, your like, and they had one. and they had you changing roles. Your gender role changed that's the case. Before. If, Yo, if, if, if you want to get there, was there. Your if role you change. Get technical, if you want to get motherfucking technical, because you was carrying purses and heels and shit, that, that, so, that, ain't, that ain't man shit. That ain't man shit. No, that that is you, definitely you, that you, is definitely man shit. If you are able to assist your woman, oh my god, that, that bullshit. <laughs> what about that's that's protecting and providing. That's providing. So what about, providing. So what about the curfew? <laughs> providing a service? What about the curfew? <laughs> that's providing. I didn't have no curfew. Oh, oh, did did this god. nigga just say he? Oh, I didn't have no curfew. No. <laughs> Fuck y'all. Did this nigga just say he I had no curfew? curfew. Fuck y'all niggas. <laughs> anyway, Dre <Jay> said, <laughs> you off cue. Just because he acted like a bitch don't mean we say it's okay to be soft. I'm not getting the parallel you draw. What? What is Q smoking? Dog, what? <laughs> that's all we trying that's to say. That's all. I mean, because like I said, I don't like, like me and money agree. I see what it is. We just want a motherfucker that, that, that hey, I need you to be just as strong as I I see am. what it is. What? what? I see what it is. Uh, Tony <laughs> told the barber said, gender roles should exist, but it's different nowadays. Men and women should provide for each other. We're supposed to build together. Yes, I would protect, but we both can provide for our family together. For sure. I yeah. see what it is. I though. need to know if this motherfucker going to pull the trigger if I, if I slip and fall. You know? I think it's, I'm, I'm the single nigga and shit. That's the only reason. I, I don't see, I don't have a family. So I, I think that's why I, I think that's why I look at that shit different. Yeah, honestly, could be. Yeah, you know. I ain't got no family. They ain't got no kids, no wife, and no shit like that. So I ain't got nobody to like. Yeah. So I, I think that's why it's different. It is. Yeah, it's different. Yeah, I, and like, and like I what you said. Want to say it? And like what you said, dog. You say some shit. You say this shit all the time because you got you got uh, well up until uh, rated R superstar. You had all girls and shit. And every time you say it in my head, though, I'm like, that don't mean shit to me. Like. With women, <laughs> all right, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say it. Come Fuck, because I just said it before. Yeah, you when it's, when, when it's women in the house, I'm not washing no fucking dishes, bro. No, that's bullshit. I'm just not. No. When it's women out, but any nigga who like money can attest for this because we live together. When, when it ain't no woman in the house, nigga, I I wash the motherfucking dishes. Mm-mm. But when it's a, when it's women no. in the crib, no, I'm not. Cause I'm not washing no dishes, bro. Me, me and the rated R, you know, we battle with that. Yeah. Get your punk ass in there and wash them goddamn dishes. I'm just saying. Was... No, he, he's he. That's something he's gonna do. He, y'all gonna share these fucking chores mm. because see now, um, you, 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 how you, much you, motherfucking, how much grass you gonna cut? How much motherfucking shoveling she gonna do? How much motherfucking trash taking out she gonna do? Like, Brooklyn. nigga, let me handle the outside. 
No, and no, you no, handled no, this? No, uh, no, no, because see, well, when you had all girls at one point, though, it was no choice. I learned this from my mother. My mother is the one that pretty much snatched that out mm-hmm. out, out, out our household. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because my auntie was appalled one day. That makes it appalled. When I went in there and started washing dishes because mm-hmm. it was just my fucking turn. Yeah. I'm literally about to turn and tell my mama, first off, I'm not doing it. <laughs> no, I yeah. was told to do something. My mother taught me <laughs> shit. <laughs> both times, I definitely been smoking. My mother taught me shit that normal mothers wouldn't teach their son. Yeah. But that shit came, that shit came, and, 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 and I mean, I appreciate the shit out of that. My mama mm-hmm. taught me how to sew. Yeah. My mother taught me how to crochet. Mm-hmm. My mother even taught me how to knit. Not my mom, a lot of motherfuckers don't even know how to, know how to do that shit. My mother taught me how to braid hair. You know how to knit, nigga? Yeah. <laughs> like, like, why is that even an asset? Because she <laughs> said... You, you, you going to knit a blanket and, you know, and, and, and she just said, and that's exactly what she said. What if you cold one day, nigga, ain't nothing but there's some yarn. What you going to do, freeze death? <laughs> that's exactly what she told me. And then so I went to my father. This nigga be knitting. No, I went to my father. With hey, you know shit. how slow this nigga drive? <laughs> you wonder how slow it takes this nigga oh, to make it. It, 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 it took me about four, five months to finish no, that. No, I bet, nigga. But I finished it. I finished the bitch. Yeah. But then when I went to my father with it, you know, I'm like, cause I thought it was girl shit. Mm. And then motherfucker snatched the shit out of my hand and finished sewing up my pants for me. Yeah. See, cause I was doing it too fucking slow. And I'm like, damn, this nigga know how to sell too. Yeah. And then and, and, uh, my mother whole process was, you're gonna grow up to be able to take care of yourself yeah. without a woman being able to do shit for you, but give you some ass. Yeah. That was her primary goal. That's why she taught me how to do all that shit, and that's why she made my sisters. Take out trash. That's why she made my sisters cut grass. That's why she made my sisters shovel snow. Yeah. We did everything. Yeah, my sister did all that shit too. <laughs> but, but, but uh, I didn't wash no dishes though. But at the, as a kid, I didn't get it. But at, uh, as older I got, and I'm getting with women that couldn't do shit, and they off looking at me like, damn, this nigga can do it pretty much anything. What motherfucker? This nigga gonna be like, he, he can't wait to say <laughs> something. What nigga? You see how happy your sister is? She did all that shit. No, <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> Bingo. She did all that Shut shit. You see how happy up. she is right now? Yeah, niggas, man. <laughs> she's happy every time I see her. She's got a fucking glowing smile on her face. <laughs> see, this nigga can't hold. This nigga can't buy a relationship from Amazon. Huh? Damn. This nigga. Wow. <laughs> nigga said I can't buy a relationship. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nah. I mean, I. I mean, I, I've 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 grown since then. Uh-huh. I've, I've washed dishes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You a caveman dirtbag, bro. Because as soon as the women come around, but you, you gotta, just sit down. What you got to understand, like, this this may, may or may not be my fault, dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to you gotta remember that I came from, like, my, my granddaddy was like, uh, my granddaddy was a, yeah, he was a nigga nigga. Like, I, I've never seen, like, my, to the day my, my, uh, my granddad died, nigga, I've never seen my granddaddy cook. Or wash dishes or do any kind of domestic shit. I never in my life seen it. Like ever. Like I I mean to the day he died, my my grandma was was literally still cutting his meat, nigga, like he was a kid. Like and this nigga like I, I remember times when my granddaddy died, we would be out. Like me, my my OG and like my grandma or somebody be gone and my granddaddy be at the crib by itself. I just seen times when my granddaddy didn't eat until my until my grandma got back home. So it's like when you see shit like that, I didn't see my old man doing no domestic shit. You know what I'm saying? So like, it, you know, whether who who's ever fought it was that I, that that's instilled in me and shit. Like I don't know. All I seen was my mama washing dishes and cooking. My sister washing dishes and cooking. Like it's it's I, hey. Yeah. So I'm I'm mm-hmm. trying to change that, but that don't mean that I that I feel like there shouldn't be any gender Two, gender roles. 2021. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> I mean, damn, Bo, I wash, I wash dishes now, nigga. Like, should I wash dishes? That's all I'm going to say. Yeah, hey, I wash dishes now. 2021. Um, <laughs> these niggas, yeah, that's what everybody keeps saying. These dudes, nigga, times change. Nigga, fuck y'all. Times ain't changed. Mm-hmm. Y'all niggas change. Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah, you right. need to get back to the old school. But yeah, you, right. see, you see how everybody, <laughs> you just named, uh, probably, you know, live within their time. Oh, shit. And they're happy. <laughs> Coco J says 2021, cute doggy dog. Oh, shit. <laughs> Let me shut the fuck up because I watched this at Earl. <laughs> yeah, that Let me a, shut the fuck up, dude. That was out of fear, nigga. That wasn't out of fear. That was out of fear. She was whipping your ass like she was whipping the kids. No, man. nobody was getting their ass whooped, nigga. Get your punk ass in there and watch some dishes. He was getting spankings. <laughs> probably, mushed, probably mushed your ass when she said it. <laughs> Nakima just checked in. What up, though? Said times have definitely changed. I, my man, he just checked in. What up, though? Cardio. 
uh, Cardio Cools, what's the deal, bro? Checking yeah, their IG. Dog, I, just, I don't know, dog. I, I think it's more of a survival thing. And, I, and that's why I'm, you know, I want my son to learn all that shit as well. Yeah, so he can do shit on his own. Because if that's the case, I would never learn how to cook. Yeah. If that was the case, you know what I'm saying? Like, my, but see, that's the thing we too. Like, all boys in my crib, you yeah. know what I'm saying? It's all boys. So yeah. somebody washing dishes, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, sure, it wasn't gonna be your mom. Yeah. No problem. Yeah. Yeah. Your somebody mom washing dishes. <laughs> they ain't washing them bitches. My mama used to wash them at first, you know what I'm saying? But then y'all niggas got old enough. Hell yeah, you better yeah. get your ass in there. Nigga, I used to motherfucker. I left because the motherfuckers want me to watch. This is the reason why I left at fucking when I was 18. I did. Yeah. I came in the house from work. Wash the dishes. It's your turn. I ain't been here all day. I'm about to wash no motherfucking dishes. I just got out of work. Man, you better wash the motherfucking dishes. Dude. Wash them next day. I was out. Fuck that. I'm not washing no fucking just dishes. Just like, so... I yeah I guess I am a fucking caveman and shit, but I just wanna I want I want to say this though too. All right so all right so yeah everybody working like this shit different. Everybody working jobs and shit. Uh, women probably doing a little bit more working than some dudes and shit. Some of them getting uh, more powerful positions, so they like higher up in corporations and shit like that. So I get it. Shit has changed. I ain't gotta keep saying that shit. Uh, Yanni just checked in. What up though? What up, uh, I just want to say this though. I some shit though. I still like maybe I am stuck in the stone age because I remember. Uh, this is a throwback, and uh, uh, nephew, if you still on there and shit, I'm gonna tell this story real quick. I remember when uh, his first his first kid and shit. I remember that uh, him and uh, his old his, his uh, baby mama and shit was uh, at my grandma's house, and they had just had the baby. And I remember that uh, <laughs> y'all niggas probably gonna laugh at me when I say this shit, but I remember when they was getting ready to leave and shit, cause I was taking the niggas home, and I remember telling dog like, uh, like shit, we about to dip like. Tell her to get the baby together. We out. So then I remember she not doing it, and he was doing this shit, getting the baby together, all this little goofy shit. So he taking the baby out to the car, all that shit. I was getting ready to drop them off. And I just like, and I'm probably wrong for this, but I was like, dog, if you got to, and this and this is purely a gender role thing that I'm probably fucked up for saying this shit because I ain't got no kids. But I'm just saying, if, you, if your whole motherfucking mama's sitting right there, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not getting kids together when we leave. Like, nigga, that's your mom. I'm just saying, like, why? Why should that, that's, that's probably why you don't have children that's now. Crazy. But what? What mama let that happen though? This a brand new baby and shit. Most mamas is not even Man, detached she, from their kid see, like that. But see, that's the problem. She probably that, had a C-section and can't carry the motherfucking baby. That, that, bro. that is the third world what the motherfucking fuck is you problem. About, bro? So like, 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 like he just said. What if she? You, you just had this baby. Something went wrong with the C-section. She got to go in the hospital for a few days. The fuck do your dumb ass do? Just sit there and just stare at the... All right, nigga, the, oh, baby, the baby wasn't two days old. Y'all niggas giving work way too much fucking crazy. The baby wasn't two you days old. The baby I don't knew. The baby is three new. months. The motherfucker's car ain't even baby. healed up yet three months, bro. That's your fucking baby. Hey, nigga, what? who said she had a C-section, motherfucker? But just the case. You what, don't know. What's wrong with you getting your baby together? What if she What? 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 what if she go down? You just going to drop the baby off at your mama's house? I mean, I ain't changed no shitty diapers so, with my first baby, but that was just because so I had this, shit this is, me. What, what was wrong with him getting the goddamn baby together? Get your, get your boy, Nick. No, oh, so God. what? So what is your, What is your, What is your papa doing? If I'm doing everything, this just like with a woman. If she doing all the nigga shit, what is the nigga doing? What you she need the nigga for? I mean, what is nigga <clears throat> shit? Huh? What is nigga shit? Provide and protect the nigga. I already defined these gender roles. <laughs> I did that shit once. I ain't gonna do it no more. Shit. Don't be mad at me, nigga, because you getting cornered over there, nigga. I ain't getting cornered, man. Shit, I, I just, I, I just. With, with your lazy cave dirt man having ass, man. Put, get, put the kids' clothes on so we can fucking go, nigga. What did Cardio Cool said you facing the double team today, dog? Tap out. <laughs> Put, get get the kid. What's bro. wrong with you getting the kid? It's your fucking kid, too. Yeah, man, you tripping. You can't do shit. Damn, can I rely on her to do something? Yes, you can, but shit, at this but point, she ain't got to it. What if I need to get somewhere fast? She moving slow. I'm going to do this shit quicker than her. What, what, what's the fucking the deal? Uh, if you, I get you, the baby you, together you feel quicker less than of her, a man because you dressed your own just, fucking kid? I guess I just don't have the experience. Like, when, whenever we was all out together and shit, my old man told my mama that he was ready to go and shit. And my mama said, all right, kids, like, shit, let's get y'all shit together. Like, my mama did that. Like, I'm just, that's what I'm used to. Like, damn, am I wrong for that shit? Nobody said you. Nobody. Like, so it, so it, if it, I tell her, if I tell her, like, shit, we get ready to go and shit, get the kids together. Like, shit, she normally going to do that shit. Yeah. It's, it sounded a little yeah. borderline to me, but you ain't wrong for it. Borderline. Borderline what? Yeah, we ain't going to say it on there. <laughs> borderline what? He know what I'm talking about. It sounded a little borderline to me, but. All right, I'm, I'm curious now that you can say it on air, nigga. Because mm -hmm. I don't understand how it's borderline when I'm telling my, my, the mother and my kids to get the kids ready. Nigga, what's borderline about that? You, you told you him can do it? The, we about to go. 
He <laughs> said, fuck it. I'm going to get the baby ready. I'll get the Myself. baby ready. I mean, what, 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 I mean, what's borderline, though? I'm curious what Angry Man talking about. What, what, uh, yeah, whatever, man. We'll talk about that later. But what? my say it is, though. Uh, that shit crazy, though, bro. Like, I don't understand how your thinking, your think process yeah, is going right it's, now. It's because off right it's now, off right now, my dog. Because you... <laughs> my man Space said, way the white flag, dog. No what battles to fight, my guy. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 seriously, like I don't know what you're thinking though, my nigga, because you, you gonna you gonna play your role. Again, I don't, have no, I don't have no family. I think that's what it is. Yes, you got to play your exactly role regardless. So if and, and in the role, if somebody else is stronger in the role than somebody else can handle, you can still be the perfect, the protector and the provider, and still play your fucking role as a as a human motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm getting the kid. That nigga Drago say dog. I really think Q playing with Devil's Advocate today. Q getting wet with the weed today. The Sherm head. <laughs> See, I'm gonna charge it to the game. God damn. I mean, I'm talking the, crazy. Getting the yeah, kids nigga. together ain't a gender role. That's a parent role. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because sometimes you may have to get this. Well, okay. You're gonna be like what Sinbad said. Both of y'all sitting on the bed. Mama gonna come in here and get us both dressed in a minute. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, goddamn. Well, Dog, you, you, you want somebody to put your socks on for you? Yeah, you ain't. Shit, if they could, nigga, shit, I'd be fat, breathing hard as hell, trying to put socks on. Nigga, shit, <laughs> am I good? You ain't your I son definitely son would. Anybody want to put a nigga socks on and shit, hit my DMs, nigga. Hey, hey. Boy. What do you tell AQ, hey, Johnny? We gonna sit here and wait till your mama come home before we eat. <laughs> We just gonna I mean, sit, I ain't gonna do that. We just gonna sit here and be home. Baby crying like a motherfucker, Monk. Hey, what my nigga Dave Spence said? Baby crying. The baby crying. The nigga, hell yeah. So baby got shit all on him and shit. And you, just sitting, <laughs> you just sitting there chilling. Yeah, son of Liberty said, Q sound like an old white man. <laughs> Don't he? Hey, my granddad was half white. That might be where I got that shit from. Straight slave master in this month. Yeah, it like, might be, though. I don't know. I'm fucking up. It's, uh, it's almost 11 o'clock. I guess it's... <laughs> Time to get out of here. Y'all niggas ain't gonna keep attacking me. Get off your ass you going crazy, bro. Nigga I'm, candy feeling, land. I'm feeling attacked. I'm feeling attacked and shit, dog. Hit me in the comment box, dog. If you got a last minute comment, dog. Should gender roles exist, dog? Um, yeah, it's a definitely a losing battle today. Yeah, because uh, it's Wednesday. Living single. <laughs> 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 your DM your just cleared out. DM's clear. Your shit just cleared out, nigga. Yeah, it living single. In the uh, 90s, kind of well. <laughs> <laughs> we are living. No, niggas gonna, niggas gonna be harmonizing. <laughs> Fuck y'all, dog. <laughs> God damn. Oh, shit, man. I'm in fucking tears. Hit me in the comment box, dog. If y'all got a last minute comment, dog. Oh, we gonna go around the block one last time. Don't forget, it is motherfucking Wednesday, so pull up on the Easy Street Saloon, man. One six one zero one East Ten Mile Road, dog. My man Chef Monk slinging chickens out the kitchen, man. Make sure y'all pull up on him, dog. That's one six what what is it? Sixteen one zero one East Ten Mile Road, dog. Easy Street Saloon. Make sure you pull up. Uh, Dre said, hopefully the real Q will be back on Friday. <laughs> I love you, my dude. I love you too, man. For sure. Y'all niggas is fooling, dog. Uh, <laughs> Space said this cat ready to run like boat. No, I'm, <laughs> I'm, fuck that. I'm sticking by what I'm saying. We gonna go around the block one last time, though, dog. Angry man, man. What's your last sentiments on the way out, bro? You know what? Like I said, I think the times back then calls for a gender role, you know, because a lot of things were different. You know, yeah. we sitting here joking, laughing, having fun about it, but yeah. a lot of things back then were different. Yeah. You know, now it's time. You know, 2021 and the 2000s, it's time for these women to step up. Yeah. You know, it's time for these men to step up, too. Yeah. You know, stop stop making it, you know, where it ain't okay where your son can't wash dishes. Stop yeah. making it okay where your daughter can't go out there and shovel snow. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because if you're a single man, I mean, if you're a single uh, mother and you have all girls, you're going to be paying somebody for the rest of your life to do this shit. Yeah. Instead of getting your ass out there and shoveling the goddamn snow. Right. And then she has to be a provider and protector now. You know, yeah. even if it's two of y'all in the house, I want her to be able to provide and protect as equally as me. That don't mean I'm going to force her to do it. Mm -hmm. I just want to know that you can do it. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Because like I said, too many times you see black, you know, families fall apart because of that. Yeah. You know what I mean? You, you see them. No, but not. It, it's not so much our mothers because our mothers still were strong women. Mm -hmm. You know, even though they did, you know be the stay home mom and they took care of everything right. if pops dipped out I, I think that era of women still could you know drive the ship yeah you know what I mean but, they did yeah, yeah. And, I, and I think a lot of times now in this era a lot of women can't because they're used to a man doing this doing that doing this doing that doing this 
Yeah. You know what I mean? Not not to shit on you uh, you ladies out there, because it's, it's still a lot of strong women out there now that's holding their shit down. Yeah, for sure. I'm going to say that, but it's, it's, I don't think it's enough. Yeah. Because, you know, of this gender thing, mm -hmm. that's a man's job. That's a man's job. A man can do that. A man can... Mm -mm. Yeah. The times right now don't cause for that. It calls for both of y'all to be equally as strong. Mm -hmm. Like you said, <clears throat> just because she is that strong, don't mean you're going to put her in that position. Right. I just, I'm just comfortable with knowing that you can do this shit mm -hmm. if 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 I fall. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I need to know you're going to keep this motherfucker rolling. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That that's, that's basically all I'm saying. Like I said, we sitting here joking, laughing, and playing about it. Yeah. But I think our time and that, that gender role was not our era. Right. You know what I mean? That, that wasn't our so era. I'm stuck in the whole shit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it ain't nothing wrong with that. You yeah. know what I mean? That's, you know, we you know... <laughs> Get you a girl, yeah, a baby on Same Amazon girl. or something. I think they sell them on Amazon right about well, babies now. Babies and women, huh? Shit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but <laughs> mail order babies. You know, I mean, <laughs> you need both. <laughs> <laughs> just, just try not to get physically, verbally, and sexually abused in the next relationship, and you, you'll be okay. Dog. Wow. Dog. What? Wowzers. Anyway, my money, dog. He'll, he'll find a word. Just nigga Dre say, uh, no last sentiments for Q today, dog. Cut out after month. <laughs> Whatever, dog. That's crazy. You say me now? Yeah, it's on you, dog. Bro, like, check it out, though. <laughs> check it out. I don't understand the protect, I mean, and the, I don't understand. Like, you, you're supposed to both have that in you. You know what I'm saying? It's supposed to be a gene that's already in you pr to protect mm -hmm. as, as a human. You know what I'm saying? Provide, you want to provide for your family. That's all in the same thing as being a human. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You want to do that, though. You don't want to see your your, your family go with fucking shits. Right. So if you got to help out and you got to provide, go ahead. Like, women brought, burn their bras to do 50-50. And they didn't have a <laughs> voice. They didn't have a voice back in those days. Yeah. So they got a voice now. You know what I'm saying? They couldn't say shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like the man was supposed to talk for everything. You know what I'm saying? But now they got a voice, bro. Because, you know, yeah. times change, bro. Like, 2021 now. That shit happened like motherfucking like in the 70s, 80s and shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? When your parents was dominated around in that time. Yeah. It, it happened in those roles. But they had to play those roles because women didn't have a fucking voice in this world. Yeah. But now they got a voice and they tearing shit up, bro. Like, what you expect me to do? You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, shit, if she fucking tearing that shit up, I'm going to ride on her coattail. She ain't going to let make me feel less of a man because me as a man, I'm not about to fucking... Take that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So if you want to be a motherfucking super strong, independent bitch, you continue being that independent bitch. <laughs> because I, I, you, don't, I, you don't need me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So okay. you know your role. You know you got to play that shit. Just play it as it go. You know what I'm saying? Like, you yeah. play your role. If she's stronger at this motherfucking shit and you're stronger at this other shit, she do that, you do this. Simple as that. Simple you know as that. that. Like, it's simple as that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know about ginger roles, but roles ain't no roles right now. Yeah. Motherfucker, everybody ain't no roles. We in this bitch. We in this bitch, bro. <laughs> like, ain't no roles right now, motherfucker. We just in this bitch, bro. Yeah. You know, you, you do your shit and I do my shit. I'm good at this. I'm going to do this. You good at this. I'm going to do this. Mm -hmm. I cook. When I'm at the crib, guess who cooking? Yeah. Hey, I'm, I wanted to taste like I wanted to taste anyway. You know what, yeah. what I'm saying? Because this is what I do. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So, I'm a fag because I'm in the kitchen cooking. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, that's what you said. Like, you, how is that what I'm saying? Because you said they play the role. Like, women, you said women because your granddaddy you ain't just never cooked. If it's a woman in the house, you, you ain't cook. washing no dishes. And if a woman, nah, I said house, I wasn't washing no dishes. I ain't saying shit about cooking. You, you said, said I wasn't washing was no dishes. Right, yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying. So you know what I mean. That made me look you less. Gotta, of, you got to cook to survive. Nigga. You, you got to make you me look less of a man because I'm cooking and washing dishes. No, I mean I wash dishes too. Now I'm just saying, but. Anyway, dog, go ahead. I'm exactly. Sorry. So this is that's what I'm saying, though. Ain't no motherfucking role, bro. And this shit, what it is, bro. And this is it's how I go. It's yeah. how I go now, in motherfucking 2021. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker, she's better at that. Let her mm -hmm. do that. Yeah. If it's voicing her opinion or doing this other shit, then hey, she's stronger at it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You either roll with her, get your ass rolled over. You know what, <laughs> what I'm saying? For real, real shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And and that's why a lot of relationships don't fucking work out because. Motherfuckers don't know how to accept that shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, accept, like, fuck. Damn, she is. Okay, shit. Fuck that bitch. She ain't about to just tell me what to do. do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. No, maybe something that she had to say is fucking right. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, it's time has changed, bro. We supposed to be a squad, a team. That's all I'm saying. Like, a that. team, bro. Like, yeah. we roll together. We supposed we made vows or we fucking 
expect to do shit in the future together, let's build together. You feel me? Let's yeah. put these bricks. I'm not the only one gonna put bricks on this motherfucker. You put bricks on it too. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> I feel you. Let's build this shit. You know how many times I couldn't go because I had I had to stay home and watch the kids. <laughs> so anyway, we gonna get to my final sentiments, which I am gonna give my final sentiments. Uh, shout out to uh, Man Attraction, baby doll. What's good? Which uh, we gonna try to we gonna try to fuck with you this weekend for real, for real. Uh, get better and shit. Hope you uh, get well soon and shit, so you be good for Saturday. Uh, but yeah, so on that note, dog. All right, so gender roles, like like I said, I think it's it's some things I guess not as cut and dry. I did have a lot of experience like with, with old school parents and fucking uh grandparents or or I say fathers and grandfathers that like, you know, wrong or right and shit, I seen some things that was like clearly defined gender roles and maybe I took some of those things with me later on, which could be why I can't keep nobody now and shit. <laughs> like it could be a situation. I th- I think that after having this conversation I, I do understand that saying some of this shit out loud. Some of it don't make sense and shit. Like, when you say it out loud, when you say it in your head and shit and you, you thinking it, it makes sense and shit. But then, like, we say it out loud and then people, you know, paint you into a corner and shit. You start <laughs> thinking a little differently about it and shit. So, I, you know, I may or may not think a little differently about it. I, I do wash dishes now. Uh, I have, uh, I, I don't really cook and shit unless it's for me. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, when I cook for me, but, like, it, when... With that, like when there's a woman in the house, more more likely like she can cook better than me. So I just let her do that shit. Cause like you you want me to cook or you want to eat some food that tastes good to everybody. <laughs> like I I cook well enough for myself. You know what I'm saying? Like for myself, I can stomach in the shit. Everybody don't like my shit, but I do make some wonderful breakfast though. I do make good breakfast though. I, I will say that thing. My fucking uh, scrambled eggs with cheese is the shit thing. But um yeah, I, I guess I can think a little bit differently about some of this stuff. Again, shout out to my granddad, man, who uh, you know passed away quite a few years ago. Um, they don't make they don't make family structures like that no more. So mm-hmm. I, I need to probably quit acting like you know that's gonna actually be a, a real thing. Mm-hmm. And again, I think that our our conversation is completely different now uh, because y'all got families and I don't, nigga. So I look at shit a little bit differently. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But uh, <laughs> right, that's yeah, that's yeah, exactly it. You right, Spank. You said quit spitting bullshit if you're not experienced, my guy. I'm not. Okay. But I'm still gonna keep spitting bullshit because it's my shit. I get to say what I want to say. So anyway, <laughs> on that note, <laughs> fuck y'all. Go wash dishes. <laughs> Go get the baby ready and shit. <laughs> we about to spit stuff. Hey, my man, uh, Easy Street Saloon today, 16101 East 10 Mile Road, dog. My man slinging chickens out the kitchen, dog. Yep. We about to get up out of here. It's 55 in the D, man. We about to uh, fuck around. I might, I might go stand outside or something. I don't even know, dog. Till the next time, dog. Whatever you go do, man, today and tomorrow, dog, make sure that you do arrive alive, dog. This is the Wake and Bake Show, dog. We in this motherfucker, dog. Yeah. For sure, dog. My man, Angry Man, holding it down. Ladies, give me one more chance. <laughs> just, just, just give, give me one more chance. <laughs> Give me one more chance. <laughs> you don't go out with a song too. Right. Check it out. If you live in <laughs> single. I'm mad these niggas harmonizing though. Buck money in the building, man. You already know. <laughs> and of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. Peace out, y'all. I let your love on phone. Y'all niggas silly as hell. Oh, shit. God damn. Yeah. Shit, God. Yeah, nice to get washed up. Fuck that shit. I, I, I ain't in that bitch, mom. Shit. Perfect.